Hey, this is Ralph Abraham with another NetLogo video tutorial. This is number seven on NetLogo extensions. We're going to examine the code in this uh, NetLogo model that has uh, one turtle and some of the patch patterns that we've seen before and uh, has a new button called test sound and clicking this uh, we get th this little ringtone. And the idea of this particular model is to demonstrate sonification, an important technique in dynamical systems theory where visual aspect of a pattern can be uh, probed and indicated with a sound response. So in this case, after pressing setup to clear the screen, and show the one turtle which is going to draw a line. I'll introduce patch pattern and then press go. Every time the yellow turtle encounters a green, a green patch, it rings the, uh, the, the tone. Th that's the idea. So the turtle is searching for patterns that are green and giving a sonic uh, report whenever finding. And this demonstrates the use of the sound extension of NetLogo, which is uh, typical of the several extensions that you can read about in the user manual. So looking at the code tab here, we have in the first line, it says extensions sound, uh, because extensions to be used have to be declared at the top of the uh, procedure page. Then under uh, setup, we have a clear all and then create one turtle, which has a, a kind of a irrational heading and a yellow color, the size three, and has the pen down to draw a line so we can see where the turtle goes. Uh, when you press the go button, this will repeat the step followed by a delay so the turtle doesn't go too fast. And uh, the step which is repeated is defined here in the step procedure. It says ask turtle zero, that's our one and only turtle, to move forward by one unit. And then in case the patch color of the patch the turtle is standing upon, which is called patch dust here, is equal to green, then execute the command in the square brackets, which is that test sound uh, routine. The test sound routine is right here under the, the go procedure. And uh, these commands preceded by sound colon are calls to the sound extension and the commands in the sound extension which are used here, uh, there are just two of them, play note and play note later. They are described in the user manual under the sound extension item in the menu. The arguments for play note, there are one, two, three, four of them, are the musical instrument, I chose trumpet, the MIDI note number, uh, which is uh, MIDI note numbers are uh, key numbers on the piano keyboard with uh, 60 indicating middle C. Uh, the volume, 64 for the volume is just a moderate uh, uh, volume and in that logo and in uh, MIDI technology in general the volume is called velocity and the duration in seconds. So hold this uh, note start immediately upon the command play note and hold that middle C note for three tenths of a second. The play note later arguments have one more so these four are the same as the play note arguments but the first argument is the delay before issuing the play note command. So we wait a tenth of a second and then hold the tone only for two tenths of a second and this note 64 is the E above middle C. 
uh, finally wait two tenths of a second and then play note 67 same volume for a tenth of a second so all three of these uh, activities will take exactly three tenths of a second and uh, 67 is the G above middle C so these three tones comprise the major triad in the key of C okay and uh, that's how we use the sound extension